Hello and welcome back. If you are new, Total OS today is total technology for beginners because we all start somewhere. Okay, as most of you know, if you don't, you should know that if you are running XP, Windows XP, it is set to retire April the 8th. And I would advise you under no circumstance should you run Windows XP past that date if you would like to be totally secure without having any possible issues. Now, you have several options. You can certainly keep running Windows XP. Don't do that. Uh, maybe you're in the market for another computer, whether it be another uh, Windows computer, Linux, or a Mac, and that's fine. Or maybe you would like to keep your current hardware, whether it be a desktop or a laptop, and maybe try Linux. If that's the case, then you have certainly come to the right place. But but before you do anything, I strongly suggest, if you haven't already, to back up anything that is important, do that first. Now, you want to do that whether an operating system was expiring or not. It's just common sense. So, if you have important documents, family photos, vacation videos, music, I think you know the rest. You want to back up everything first. And I would suggest doing what I do, buying both external hard drives and uh, USB sticks. Now there are various combinations, storage capacities. I listed four here for you to try. As far as the USB sticks, I have maybe a half a dozen of these. Now of course you don't need that many, but I use these here to uh, run and test uh, various Linux distributions and creating USB bootable sticks. Now if you are new to this and have no idea what that means, don't worry about that about that this video is not about bootable USB sticks this video is about backing up everything first hopefully before viruses back up now or a cry later so before you do anything I strongly suggest that you back up any important information first and I would back it up twice I have two external hard drives and I have about a half a dozen of these sticks so if by chance one hard drive goes bad you know, you dropped it, you spilled coffee on it, or whatever you have, what I would call an emergency backup. Now, before you do this, one word of caution. If the file you want to back up has a virus, you would be also, <laughs> I guess you would also back up your virus, so to speak. So before you transfer or back up any information, make sure you run a virus scanner first on those file or files. You want to make sure first that the files are clean before you back up anything and that's really the purpose of this specific video number one XP retires don't continue it number two run the virus scan on anything important that you wish to back up once you are satisfied then you should certainly back up anything that is important to at least two external pieces of external hard drives now whichever ones you want to pick that's up to you as I said I have two external hard drives and a bunch of these USB sticks just to make it more convenient for myself so whether you are thinking about switching from XP to Linux or maybe thinking about buying another computer and that could be any computer I suppose Windows Mac or Linux or whatever you want to back up clean files first and I stress to back up clean files first because if you back up files with viruses that you didn't know you have and you buy a new computer and install those <laughs> virus files guess what your new computer has viruses all right I hope that made sense all right I will post links below in the show notes for those of you who follow the channel if you wanted to vote for the latest poll two days left not so much not too much interest in this the poll is would you buy a smart watch all right, that's it. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new for more stuff. And as always, I will catch all of you sometime in the future.